Hello everybody, welcome to this amazing game of Ah Pwash versus Hu Yi, Jimmy Snake 2 is a... Oh boy, Grand Masters, man. This is gonna be great, this is gonna be wonderful, let's do it. Cause this is, this is what I want in life, right? No, not really. This is gonna hurt, this is gonna hurt real bad. Oh, we're gonna die. Everything about us is bad. Okay, um... Could Sanctuary. His ult's gonna be huge. I don't have a jump like he does. Um. Shit. I guess we're just gonna have to Sanctuary. I. I. Mm, I don't. I didn't. Didn't think about that very well when coming up with ideas on what the hell I'm supposed to be doing here. Alright, so he gets a little bit of experience. And nothing I can do about that. Ho oh, ye problems, yo! Aw. Oh. He's gonna have to somehow. Oh boy. And of course he's practiced. That's bad. That's real bad, yo. Oh, I didn't blow him up. Let's just give him a little tap 47 damage. Oh, okay. So, do I get red now? Yeah, I do. I'll see him coming around that corner if he dares, tries to do anything I wouldn't, you know, regret or something. Okay, so now we can just go ahead, long range clear. Trying to get more mana here. Yeah, just gotta keep my health up, I suppose. And go for it. Yeah. I'm gonna just try to damage him. Yeah, I am out of mana. Can we not? Oh, he got Sunder! No! No! I didn't think- Who gets Sunder? Ah, <laughs> uh, I'll wait for the boots. It's not very long. I didn't think he'd be able to that fast. Sunder, I- I would've- Would've aged that if I knew. I got ages for that reason. Just to avoid some unnecessary death. So we'll go ahead, just do what I can. Clear what I can, I almost had it, but giving Hoi first blood, even though I got red, it's gonna end me pretty bad here. Aww, used up all my potions too trying to survive that shit. So this is gonna, this is gonna be a little rough. We're gonna, we're gonna have to play this a little rough. Just gotta be very wary of uh, any any of those things. Just go ahead and grab those. Oh! There we go. Ooh, got that payback though. That's what we're talking about. So I've got the two corpses already, and so Corpse Bomb is is the next pickup that's going to be very vital to me. Um, on top of that, I have to be able to clear real fast, um, because as he catches up to me, <coughs> Hunters become very viable late game, like beyond viable. So this is going to be hard to fight at the later game. Um, with him having lifesteal, um, I'm all about burst, really, so I have to utilize my passive of picking my corpses back up to get anything on him. Uh, just keep him as down as possible. Thankfully, he used to jump aggressively. There we go. So, we're gonna get aggressive here while we can, because he's stacking. Okay, I'll get my mana back. Ooh. 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 
Ooh. <laughs> Just a little fart, don't mind me. Oh, don't be scared of me. I'm only really terrifying. Okay. So I do have two corpses over here set up, which we're now going to utilize. She can't exactly stop this. Nope. No thanks. Oh! Oh! Got it! He's dead. <laughs> He's got a, a Master's emote, or Master's border from, um last year which is pretty cool <laughs> it's nice to see people playing that so I'm gonna want a poly as well now that I think about it I don't know why I wanted warlocks but maybe we'll get a poly maybe uh, let's start working on Valor or Thoth depending if I can if he gets chins I'm gonna need to get Valor or something um, to really kind of tone down the damage he can deal to me um, he didn't get sprints Yay! Oh, there we go. So corpse bombs, most important. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Nobody. So we're just gonna use this to heal. Oh God! How is he missing these? Either it's lag or something. They, they, they're almost going right through me in a sense. Okay, so we definitely want to see if we could steal his blue before... He definitely took his own blue already. Damn. Oh yeah, son. Take it. Take it real good. Da, 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 da. Oh, come on, damn it. Oh. Ow. Ah, he's not playing very nice. I kind of want these. Kind of want this. Oh god. This is bad. Not only did I just steal that, but uh, I'm gonna die. Yeah, I don't think so. Die for your Two. That's what I thought. I, that's where I was gonna get at this, son. You might not want to do that yet. Mm. Delicious heels. I'll, uh, I'll let him have it. <coughs> Nothing I can really do to stop it, to be fair. Um, two, six. Ah, uh, let's get both. I think it'll be important. Um, just in case he gets a frostbound. I do want sprint. I do want to be able to get out of things. I do want to be able to, in case a frostbound comes my way, I want to be able to stop that. And refresh that blue, though. No, he's not taking big butt. Oh, whoops! That may have gone in a wrong direction. Let's uh, pick those back up, no problem. Yeah, no, no, you're gonna have to, have to take the owl. It farted at him. It's it's a good start. It's a thing that can happen here. Die, 
Oh. Okay. Oh no! I F'd! I pressed F. That didn't. Eh, I pressed F. I didn't press F fast enough, clearly, but. <coughs> In my eyes, F was pressed. There goes the entire middle tower. Hasten Fatalis. Um, I should get ISO. I can get ISO next. Um, depending on the situation, I'm just gonna have to play it safe. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. He's getting into that late game chin size hunter bullshit. Did he clear the wipe again? So there's. da ah, fudge. Well, that's a shitter. Now we go get some stacks. Um, I still have my alt. I really flubber knocked that last engagement up pretty hard. Oh, he's lining me up. Yeah, I'm gonna need ISO. If I intend to beat this hunter... Whoa, wait, what? I moved my mouse, it wouldn't... Damn it. Ow. Okay, so we might be okay here. I mean, you're gonna die eventually if you keep this up. got away from me. Yeah, there he was. But I get red now. Thank you very much, Mr. Misterton. And there goes red. So we're gonna want Valor, uh, but I also want Isolation. It's gonna be rough. Rough to decide between. Um, if he goes for Big Bud, I just gotta go stop it. I don't think he has the power to take Big Bud immediately, but... I don't see why he wouldn't walk over there. Yeah, he's not over there. Would have heard it, would have seen it, would anything, everything would have confirmed that he was doing it. Yeah, he's tell us though. Oh! Aw, oh, sucks. Alright, well, we gotta play the safety game. Fortunately, uh, he does have lifesteal. I do have a heal. Of sorts. I gotta be careful. I can see him taking it from here. Should have effects. If he does end up getting it, I'm in huge trouble. Go ahead, jump over. You're hurt, man. I saw that HP. Oh, you're hurt. Master. Die for your master. Oh, you're hurt. Ow. Oh, but you're hurt, son! Damn it. Ah! Even with Sprint, I couldn't keep up with it. Damn dashes. get him next time. I can get ISO though. That's really what I'm looking for. Yes, I know, I know. I actually want isolation and a couple of wards. <coughs> as long as I can see him go for big butt, I I know what to do. Goddamn tutorial lady, you just never shut up. This way is okay. So again, just keep an eyes out for him. Boop. You, you can get that Sunder and whatever combo you just tried to pull off. That ain't gonna work against my Aegis. What? <laughs> oh, he killed all the minions, though. Dingleberries. Yeah. 
Damn it. Well, at least I can come back with Valor. And because of that, he doesn't have anti-slows, which means, for him, good game. I have ISO. So he has to deal with that. Alright, so I should have time to get out. And I'll know if he's going for what I don't want him to. And he's getting defenses now, so I have to be ultra careful. Uh, I will be getting spear over any other type of pen. Um, to which I'm lacking a real power item for, but... Uh... Yeah, I see you. Yeah, my that hurts, doesn't it? Like that chip damage? I like just slowly eating him away. It's my favorite. Go ahead, go back to that group. I dare ya. Go ahead, go go back to Big Bar. I dare ya. I double dog dare ya. I'm so confident. I'm not confident at all. Please don't. <sighs> Damn life steal. Whoop! Ooh. Ooh. I have 43 seconds left on that. I'm not doing it. Hi, buddy. Oh, that has life steal and. Hi, buddy. Yep, you are backing. For reasons I, I truly can't understand. <coughs> but I need that spear. I need some pen right now. Alright. Oh, shit. I need a ward right now. Need two wards. Stat! Okay, again, if he gets that, I'm in trouble. Zebra. I'll keep him off it. <laughs> There's a ward. There's another ward. Yeah, go ahead. Frost. Fa get, get your little Hasten Fatalis Frostbound going, man. I'm good with it. Oh, man. Those slows, though. Those slows hurt, don't they? Ah, oh, they're, they're great. They're delicious, almost. Oh. All right, well, I can get spear. That's the big thing. It won't be immediate burst damage, but everything I do over time will now hurt him. Um, he doesn't have any... It's weird. It's like he doesn't have real pen. He only has 20 points of pen. I have a very high defensive item. I'm not sure that 20 pen is going to help him. He needs a Titan's Bane or an Executioner. I. Oh shit! Son, slowed for days. Ah oh, shit! He can see me now. Ooh. What's he doing? Your middle phoenix is under attack. What? Oh, whoopsie. Die for your master. Ring it, bitch! Die for your master. You like that? I like that. It's good damage. Let's play this game. Come on. Oh shit. Oh shit. I meant four, but... Ooh. All right, I don't know where he's at. I'm back to health, though. Oh, that was scary. That was that was kind of terrifying. Not gonna lie. I haven't left, so still only got whatever it is that I have. All right, I don't have anything there. I 
hit him. Not for much, though. I gotta land. Gotta land the poison thing. There we go. Slow those buns down, hon. Honey bunny. Get your buns back here. I mean, it doesn't heal you to kill them at all. It's so weird how he has to focus this all down. Ugh, this is so freaking annoying. Okay, it like touched him, not by much. Gotta keep it as distant as possible. Take those slows, hon. Honey buns? Stab it! Am I hitting them? Okay. It doesn't do them any good. There we go. That's some good damage right there. Alright, that was slow. It's all about. There we go. So, yeah, it's just all about the overall damage. Two seconds. Ah, uh, yes, I understand. Gold is good. I'm thinking about swapping my warlocks out. Yeah, yeah. Warlocks for, uh. <coughs> You know what, I think I'll make the change. Let's sell Warlocks for Rod. They'll give me more power. I, it seems like even though um, I'm landing a couple of things, the pen's not enough. Uh, and it will not really be enough for a while. So he's not, he's gonna go for Big Butt right now. Uh, no, no, ooh, he didn't take it. He thinks I have it warded. Fantastic. Got him. It's not necessarily. Oh. That's all it's about. Just that poke. Just that initial poke, baby. Come on, baby. Don't run from me now. Alright. I mean, he's, he's getting greedy here. I love it. Run, bitch! Oh, take the damage! Come on, minions! No, no, you survived? Okay. Damn, son, still got it. This is, this is hot. This, I'm beating a whole year. It feels good, yo. <laughs> this way! is revealed <laughs> it, it really is you know i'm shocked he hasn't gone for frostbound himself that's gotta be a heavy slow too he's gotta land those if he wants to put an end to me that'll slow him that'll damage him that'll damage him slows him it's all about that damage, yo. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Someone's in trouble. I'll be taking this, thank you. Ah. 
<laughs> this is maybe a little unfair. Oh shit. Oof. Oof. Oh, better pick those up. Oof. Yes, a tutorial lady, don't lower my music. I fucking need this shit. Oh shit, that's game. <coughs> that sucked. Lifesteal was my bane and I didn't even kill the enemy. Ah oh, shit, yeah. He's got a huge wave of minions. I can't. I can't win it. Um, it doesn't matter. I at most maybe kill, he'll kill the Phoenix. Uh, should be able to tank the Titan pretty hardcore. I don't know what to do at this point. Like, ugh, to have lost that, it's a rough life. Because he can kite it if I'm not mistaken. And that's what he's likely gonna do. Yeah. Oh shit! Oh shit! Um, maybe. I can maybe do this. If I keep him on his side of the map, I can still maybe do this. But I need minions and shit. Oh my god. If I get this, you gotta be kidding me. If I get this, you gotta be kidding me. No fucking way. It's on, bitch! It is on. Oh, it is so fucking on. You don't even know, hun. Oh, you got Oboe? I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. Uh, no, hun. I don't think so. I don't, I don't fucking think so. I don't fucking think so, you Pete. No. Oh, fuck no. Oh, your greed. Your greed is going to be the end of you, bitch. Oh, you should have fucked me. Oh, this game. I can't believe you couldn't finish it. Oh, thank you, God. <laughs> the greed. It got to him. No way. Oh. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Oh shit! I could have. Jeez, he almost had it too. The way he died at the end was a little rough. I don't know if he like was hoping that his ultimate was gonna be enough. Uh, but oh man, good game! <laughs> Hello everybody, welcome to this amazing end screen of Smite. Um, I originally recorded it and then I wanted to re-record it because I got into a long tangent. Of in the end, this player, if I remember correctly, was Masters of last year and has the border to prove it. The problem is, is that this person... Lost Top Watch is one of the top tier gods. Instead of really reviewing his own build, he just goes to call me cancer for picking up a single item. Gem of Isolation. But that's like saying Poseidon's cancer for picking up Isolation. Sorry, but the item exists to slow you down, just like Hasten Fatalis is there to speed you up. There are relics, items, and other sources you can use to counter the effects of isolation. So for you to be all toxic, like look at that, look at that. He's, uh, he's like calling me cancer and the one word I had for him was who ye, cause uh, if I'm not mistaken, who ye has been very powerful all year long in season three and this is just a little ridiculous. I I don't know how to help him. Did he get cocky and greedy when he saw me? Did he think that, ah, uh, it's an op watch who doesn't know what he's doing. 
Um, Sunder. Just for lols. Hey, you know what's funnier? Thorns. Get it. If you got Sprintin' Aegis or Sanctuary, you, you, you could have avoided all the effects in which I had. Yeah. His choice in build throughout this entire game was really questionable. Getting beat stick to counter a heal in which I don't have was a little mundane on top of now picking up uh, Executioner for whatever reason made no sense to me. So let's go over the builds and how they work. If you saw, I picked up Spear of the Magus earlier in the game because landing the dot would apply all the effects of Spear of the Magus, allowing me to deal maximum damage. However, um, Obsidian Shard turned out to be the best choice in the end only because I wasn't landing the dot, uh, which is my three. Um, so in order to compensate, we got rid of Spear and we went with Obsidian Shard in order to more guarantee damage if I wasn't being accurate enough. Um, the Breastplate of Valor is a defensive pickup. In, in Duel, everybody needs a defensive item. You have to get one defensive item, and, and one that gives a good amount of protections, because you need to reduce their damage by 50%. Um, they will get penetration to deal slightly more damage, uh, but it's just, you need the defense. Uh, defense will protect you depending on, uh, if it's against a physical guy to defend you against objectives as well, defend you against minions. Uh, I also swapped out Warlock Sash for Rod to Hootie later on because I realized I was going to get Gem of Isolation. Gem of Isolation would have been a better first pickup uh, over Warlock Sash. So, for example, getting Gem of Isolation in the placement of Warlock Sash would have been the smarter move. And um, The Book of Thoth is the second most powerful item you can get as a mage as regarding power only, not passives. Uh, well... Including passives of power. The stat of power is the second most powerful, with Ratuhuti being the most powerful. Ratuhuti also has a hidden effect that your basic attacks are also increased by an additional 25% for some reason. Doesn't say it, but it is. So you get 25% of your magical power tacked on to your uh, overall power. 20% of all that power is put into your basic attacks. Then 25% of all your power is apply to your basic attacks for some reason. If they finally change that, somebody let me know, but if I remember correctly, when I left Smite in the beginning of Season 3, that was how this item worked then. Um, picking up Shoes of Focus over the Pen Boots, uh, which is Shoes of the Magi. Um, this is a cooldown thing, also gives you mana um, and a little bit of power. You get the Pen Boots if you don't need the cooldowns. You get the cooldowns if you don't need the Pen Boots, or if you know, there's... There's only so many characters I actually get pen boots on, and Anubis is not one of them. I will always get cooldown boots, I believe, on Anubis. Um, I, I, it used to not be that way. I used to get pen boots, uh, but because they uh, reduced the overall cooldowns available, I think it was 20% or 15% on boots, now it's only 10. Uh, Pythagorum's piece or Pythagorum's or whatever the hell you want to call it is that that's a story for another build that's not here right now. Gem of Isolation was the winner of the day here, especially because who ye forgot to pick up? Sprint. And when you don't pick up Sprint, oh god, get in the way of Frostbound or Isolation, and you're going to be slowed for days. Him trying to outrun me at the end there was pretty funny, because what he was going to do is just run and just take out the Titan. The problem is... I had isolation. That slowed him down, even though he had more movement speed with Haste and Fatalis tacked on him, I dunked on him. Be simply because he underestimated the effects of isolation. Which it was weird why he jumped over the wall there, even though I would have cut him off. He could have gone through the jungle and gotten a little more time on that, but I don't know how well that would have gone for him. Um, might have gone great, I don't know. In the end though, uh, it was a base rush, and he he got a little greedy, and he didn't he should have if he was gonna go that greedy, I would have seriously just sold Odysseus bow and picked up wing blade. That way, when you got slowed, you would have just been sped up, and you would not have died. It's a pretty good pickup. Uh, regarding his build, if he he's calling me cancer here because I picked up isolation, but little did everybody know there's an item called winged blade. Winged blade counters slows and what that does is it makes you faster when you get slowed for a brief period of time while also tacking on health and movement speed like what's that you could have ran faster okay but he wanted to sit here and complain because his choice of building was terrible 
Um, he sacrificed his only damage item, which was Chin Size, for Odysseus Bow. Well, he act it was actually in the spot of execution. But you have Odysseus Bow, which you, you're, you're removing, like, the most powerful hunter item in the game, which is Chin Size, for a very shitty item in the game. For duel, that is. My mind you, it does work well when there's several enemies in the way. Um, the additional attack speed is not going to help you. It's not all about attack speed when you don't have the damage item. Hunters have to go down two routes. Chin size or crits. One or the other. If you don't go down it, you are the lesser hunter out of every hunter that will ever be born ever. Because if a hunter picks up chin size or crits and you have neither, you will be dunked on so hard, it's not even funny. It's just how hunters are. Uh, it's the meta. Uh, but chin size is more meta than crits because it's guaranteed damage with attack speed, more accurate, blah, 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 blah. In the end, uh, choice of relics screwed him. Choice of items screwed him. He was doing okay. He had the game in his hands, and he dropped the ball so hard. He got so cocky, he dropped the ball. So with that being said, Mr. Huyi, I honestly can't believe you are a Masters of last year because you're who you and you lost to an opwash um i like to me that's unheard of i haven't seen and i honestly haven't seen an opwash played in duel since opwash first came out when he was broken and i nerfed him uh but i don't know how else to say that like you can't go around guys you can't can't go around calling people cancer when you are playing the cancer of duel. Ah, uh, hooey. And, uh, bitching about op wash and an item that has counters to it. it. I left Smite because of the community being terrible. Duel community's toxic as shit. I'm shocked that we even have a community going. Or, no, actually, I, I'm... Let me rephrase that. Back in Season 1 and Season 2, there were games going on all the time. I can't find games anymore. They're 15-minute queues. This is ridiculous. Nobody is playing because you all treat each other like shit. Like, my mind is blown. N no one co collabs anymore. Everyone talks shit about each other. I mean, everyone talks shit about each other. I don't think there's any friends in Duel anymore. I don't know what the fuck happened to all of you. It's a sad day for Duel. Well, it's been a sad year for Duel, but... Hopefully in Season 4... We actually maybe stop being stupid and make the mode likable, maybe? Because people, people ain't going to join if you're being a little bitch about things. Especially if you're a little bitch losing an op wash. I mean, come on, don't... Oh, I see. Uh, I'm sorry. I called him a little bitch. All right, this is like... It just irks me, guys. I want you to know. It hurts me to see that people who were in Masters who should make this mode appealing to new people so they can get into playing Duel and have fun keyword have fun and then you know you play so hard to win that when you lose you can't accept that fact you can't accept that you lost to an op wash so suddenly you must treat your opponent with disrespect because you lost just this isn't the first guy to do it either in stream i i stopped streaming smite that day the moment it happened someone i knew lost to me I think I was some guardian or, or something that I don't, I don't even remember. Uh, but I was called Cancer, and I sucked. I had no skill. And I'm like, I'm playing the lowest tier gods I can, and I have no skill, and you're upset at me. You're angry at me. Okay, this makes no sense. I think it, no, I don't think it was going quite. But in the end... I had to put the game down and I had to say, wow, that was, a, that was a friend, was a friend, and now it's like, what the hell happened to you guys? If you guys can let me know, what happened to the duel community while I was gone? This, this ain't duel. This hasn't, this ain't duel. I, I haven't had, well, if you don't like somebody, you wish them a good game, you'll walk away. That, that's it. That's just the line right there. You don't have to be a dick to anybody. God. Oh, sorry to watch another friend just kind of slip into the slip into the toxic side of the community. I don't know. I don't know a good duelist anymore. Like a nice, kind duelist. It irk. It's sad. Don't. I don't. It's it's a bad day. It's a. I'm going to have a rough day with this one, but thank you everybody for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and as always, 
Ugh, good game.